Once upon a time, in the heart of a sprawling, sun-drenched savanna, there lived a curious, young emu named Elio. Elio was not like the other emus. While they spent their days, pecking at seeds and exploring the vast expanse of their home, Elio yearned for something more. He would often gaze wistfully at the shimmering horizon, wondering what lay beyond. The familiar grasslands. One particularly bright morning, as Elio was admiring the clouds painted across the sky, he heard a melodious humming coming from the edge of the forest. Intrigued, he hurried over to investigate. There, nestled under the shade of an ancient gum tree, sat a wise old koala named Cora. Cora was known throughout the land for her storytelling prowess and her gentle wisdom. Elio, my young friend, Cora greeted him with a warm smile. What brings you to my humble abode today? Elio shuffled his feet nervously. I, I've always wondered about the world beyond our savannah, he admitted shyly. Do you think there's more to life than just pecking seeds and running around? Cora chuckled softly, her eyes twinkling with understanding. Ah, uh, young Elio, the world is full of wonders beyond our wildest dreams. Sit with me, and I shall tell you a tale of bravery, friendship, and the magic that lies within each of us. Eagerly, Elio settled beside Cora, his eyes wide with anticipation. And so, Cora began to weave Hartala. Once, in a land far, far away, there lived a brave young emu named Alara. Like you, Elio, she yearned to explore beyond her home. One day, she embarked on a journey across vast deserts and dense forests guided only by the whispers of the wind and the stars above. On her travels, Elara encountered many creatures, wise old tortoises who shared tales of ancient times, mischievous platypuses who taught her the joy of laughter and gentle, kangaroos who showed her the true meaning of kindness. But it was her encounter with the mystical emerald dragon that changed Alara's life forever. The dragon, though fearsome in appearance, possessed a heart as vast and as warm as the sun itself. Together, they faced trials and tribulations, learning from each other and forging an unbreakable bond of friendship. In the end, Alara realized that the greatest adventure lies not in the places we explore, but in the hearts we touch along the way. And so, she returned home, carrying with her the wisdom of the world and a heart full of stories to share. As Cora finished her tale, the savanna seemed to hold its breath, enchanted by the magic of her words. Elio looked at Cora with newfound admiration, his heart brimming with a sense of wonder and possibility. Thank you, Cora. Elio whispered gratefully. I never knew that such adventures could exist, right here in our own world. Cora patted Elio gently on the back. Remember, dear Elio, every journey begins with a single step and yours has only just begun. And so, with a newfound sense of purpose and courage, Elio bid farewell to Cora and returned to his fellow emus. From that day on, he would often gather his friends under the gum tree and regale them with tales of
Thank you.